Hey everybody, it's 8 Blaze here with Ryan and Sarah. Today we'll be playing our most likely last episode of Mega Dimension Neptunia. We're just gonna go We're through... trying to do all the in-game stuff. Like all the DLC and whatnot. I apologize for the wait. The tea is done. I'm sorry for calling you here so suddenly. Allow me- oh wait. Me. Right Allow now. me to partake. Mmm, this is really quite delicious, Vert. There's so much yaoi in the back. Darjeeling is one of the- I'm pretty sure I said that right. It's one of the three most famous teas. You could call it the king of teas. I think it's Darjeeling? Darjeeling? Whatever. Whatever, it doesn't matter. Ha! <laughs> huh, what a way to phrase it. So what is your business today? I assume you did not call me simply for a cup of tea. Hmm, of course not. Let's get straight to business. As a card game enthusiast, I've been curious for quite some time as to what a knight actually is. If possible, I'd like to use them myself, but they seem limited to only you, so I thought I could at least ask you about them. If you don't mind, could you tell me about their construction? How do you create a knight from using elements? Also, are elements something special that only those chosen possess? An element is like partial data read from information on one's personality and strength. Therefore, all living things possess it. Which means, if you were to use my element, you would create a knight with a lovely body. There is some randomness in what is read off, but that is the general idea. It would be faster to show you rather than explaining it. I believe I had some elements stocked up somewhere. Ah yes, here we go. Within this are the elements. Now then, I will place this element into my crown. There. The crown has begun to shine. I will show you my caliber. And that is how you create a knight. I didn't realize that crown was a device call to call forth knights, so it wasn't simply a, fa simply fashion a fashion accessory. I'm Normally knights are created from what is called a lake, but my crown is like an improvised version. One can't keep dragging around the created knights, so they are transformed into cards, like so. It's almost like convenient summoning magic. Oh my, how wonderful it fires me up. It is applied to summoning, but it's possible to use a knight's power through a card, too, for attack, attacks, or healing spells. However, you cannot use a knight's power simply with a card. It is usable only when first set on this round table model on my left arm. Only author, ar, wow. Only Arthurs are allowed possession of this item similar to Excalibur. I see. I've come to understand it all, but it's still most disappointing that I'm not able to use it then. By the way, you have many card cases worn around your waist. Are they all filled with knights? Correct. A single deck cannot cover all possible situations, after all. This deck is for serious battles, this one for cheery overfishing, and this one is mainly dark element and all target attacks. This deck with a singular card is a one-punch deck I used quite an, an age ago. There is quite a variety of decks, isn't there? By the way, Millie, by chance I have various articles that were previously used by Netgear and the other CPU candidates. Oh? It is said a person's feelings are left within their belongings. You understand my meaning without me having to elaborate, yes? Oh, but of course. Ho oh. ho ho. <laughs> I had an errand nearby, so I decided to come and visit Bird. Bird, are you here? Huh? She's not here. I thought she said she'd be in her room all day. Hmm, it seems really lively over in that direction. It's from the public baths. Could everyone possibly be taking a bath together? Do you get what's happening? Oh, Neptune! Neptune, did she not hear me? So everyone really is taking a bath together. Wait, I'll join. Bird, are you here? I'm entering. Oh. Do you get what's happening? She created copies. Huh? Huh? What in the goodness is this? Oh, welcome. Sorry for the slight lag. We had to stop for a minute. You're a knight, right? Would you like to join our bath too? New knight. New knight. Oh, what the? Why am I? Big Sis Vert, you're the best. Big Sisters? I thought more cups of juice. I brought. I brought more cups of juice. 
Oh, I'm in heaven. Big sis, is it not a bad ring to it? No, it is in fact the best. I just realized that was Millie and Arthur. Yeah. Big sis Millie, here's a straw, open wide. Oh. Uh, Dear me, you are a good girl who is thought for of her elder sister. Here, allow me to praise you. Eek! Big sis! Hmm, what is the matter, Nepier? More! <laughs> squ she squished more! <laughs> oh, the is broken. Hey, it's not fair that you keep getting praised, Nepier. Hmm, I will squishy squishy all present here, too. Yay! I love you, Big Sis Bert! That's not fair, Nepgear. Me too! Hey, I want Bert to give me attention too. There's no need to worry. I will give all of you attention from the, from the tops of your heads to the nails on your feet. Now, remove all unnecessary things and leap into my chest. What, they're towels? Well played, Bert. <laughs> this is the stage to show my king's caliber. Now, everyone, don't hold back. Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay. It isn't okay at all. What are you doing, you two? Oh, this knight has yet to become attached to us, it seems. In such a violation of manners, wearing clothes in the bath area. What is grace of a knight? However, this is exactly when we can show the extent of our skills. You are quite right. Let us win over this one like all the knights before her. Huh? What? Huh? Now entrust your body and soul to your older sisters. No! <laughs> hey, Millie, what are you doing? Eh, Chikama. You didn't have to do something like this. If you wanted a bath together, I would have... Er, no, 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 no. You shouldn't be wasting crystals like this. By what do you mean wasting? Is there possibly any other method more useful than this? No, there isn't. That's right. Really? Vert, the vert over there? Was this the reason you lured me over to another nation? Location. Location? Sorry. Uh, oh, how was your tour of Lingbox? Did you find any hints about elements? Yes, thanks to you, I now know that if I take my eyes off Millie and let her make nights as she pleases, nothing good will come of it. Er. I'm confiscating all of these knights. Ugh, my adorable younger sisters. My older sister is Neptune. From now on, you need to you need the person's permission to take their element, okay? I see them. I may do so if I have permission. <laughs> then Vert, Napgear, give me your elements. Oh, you're fine with mine as well? You can't have it! <laughs> I see. No, even if you're unwilling now, I will soon open your heart. Mwah! <laughs> oh my god. Ah, this is exactly why I hadn't taken any elements from everyone. Okay, I learned stuff. Cool. Yeah, they learned a combo move. Okay, where else can I check go? Check the, um... Oh, actually check the con... This? Yeah, check those okay. things. Because Million Arthur's are the only ones that are converse. That's what I was thinking. Oh, she actually has... Okay. Yeah, everybody's got a bunch. That's why I said we're... This. This is weird. What, raw meat? You the raw meat, yeah. Oh, that's the raw meat person that people have been talking about, huh? Even if game industry is known as a land not ruled by common sense, I can't say I've seen a living slice of meat before. I wonder if it's an endangered species. If I cut a piece off of it, would it grow again? I wonder if I can use it as a specimen. Oh, she's getting pissed. I was totally joking around, although I am pretty curious about where you found it. I met her in my hometown on the PC continent. Raw Meat doesn't really like to talk about herself, though. However, she did mention once that a s scholar performed a ritual and summoned her from another world. Of all the things out there that could be summoned Raw Meat, I would have gone with a dragon or a unicorn. <laughs> what? Raw Meat is way cooler than either of those things. Way prettier, too. Um. I guess some people cut up, guess some people cut up meat to look all decorative, but she just looks like she just looks kind of thin and not tasty at all. Wait, if she was summoned, that means someone had a specific purpose for bringing her here, right? I'd hope she was an ally, but what if she is actually an enemy, enemy biological weapon of some kind? 
It's okay, nothing like that is going on. Raw meat is like my own flesh and blood. She wouldn't do anything bad. Right, sorry I doubted you. It just seems a little crazy to me still. Well, in the past, her tribe did try to take over the world, but I think a magic grimoire and a god machine stopped it. Oh, you're talking about that tribe. Yeah, I'm not gonna get that reference. There's still more! I didn't get that reference either, so. Ha! Yeah, these are the scenes. To get, these are the scenes to get all their ultimate weapons. All right, I think that was the last of them that were hiding out here around here. Who's ultimate weapons? The DLC characters. Oh. Dealing with them one at a time isn't difficult, but since there are so many, many, this has proven to be a challenge. Oh, Nitro Plus, your plus, jeez, your shoes appear to be pretty dirty. Words today. Hmm. Oh, this is nothing at all. There's a river over there if you'd like to wash them quickly. Meat. Oh sure, I can do that. It might be good to wash up a little while we have a minute to rest. Hey, why are you removing all of your clothes? Okay. I just said I was going to wash up. I wonder if public nudity is a new international trend. Well, we don't know who might walk by at any given moment. Washing your face and hands should suffice. Words. Suffice. Lighten up. No one in their right mind would be lurking over here knowing that those criminals are around. But there's a chance that an enemy might still be staking this area out. Well, even if there was an enemy, all we gotta do is beat the crap out of it. But... Hey, listen to me! Ooh, this feels so good washing up after such an intense job is really satisfying. Splash. The cold water feels really good on my legs. Raw meat kind of looks like cold shabu shabu though. Oh, I should go stand watch and make sure no one's suspicious is lurking about. We're fine, Vert. No one's here. Hey, what is that? Do you always wear such risque clothing while you're on a job? There we go. What's risque? That underwear you're wearing is practically a shoestring. It's hardly battle appropriate. Well, yeah, but it's so easy to put on and take off. You should try some out sometime, Vert. I have a few bikinis, but I would never wear them in a battle the way you do. What if it came undone? I don't care if an enemy sees anything. It's not like he'd be living very long after meeting me in battle anyway. That actually makes a lot of sense. Not to change the sub subject, but I think I'm beginning to realize how much you enjoy killing evil people. Hmm? I'm suddenly getting an urge. What would happen if I grab this and pull? What the? Why are you taking this off? <laughs> it's your fault for wearing it in front of me. Yeah, it's the biggest perv Girl. in the world. Should I pull on it a little more? How about we just take it off completely? Which sounds better? Neither. Didn't you just tell me to not get naked? All this naked talk has really got my mind racing. <laughs> You sound like a perv. Er, bummer. Fine, I'll retaliate. I'm going to make you undress too, Vert. Raw meat, help me. Okay. Hey, this isn't a very safe place to do this to me. I'm a CPU, don't go crazy. Whoa. Did we get another picture? Oh, we don't get another picture. Achoo. <sighs> that was bad. I need to dry my clothes. I just need to use this skill a little softer than usual, yeah? Still, I can't. Still, storm. I'm really the victim here. I was able to wash up at least. Raw meat was also able to bathe and seems pretty clean now. The wind feels so nice. Meat. Just be careful not to dry yourself too much. You might become jerky. Anyway, that stringed bikini. I can appreciate you wearing it, I suppose. You should try it out, Vert. It's really not so bad. Besides, if you wear it, I'll have to repay you for today. What? I think I'll leave the bikini wearing to you in that case. I feel like we're just going to be doing verse. We are. According to my intel, Horia choose negotiation, yeah, negotiation will be held just beyond this point. Words today. And that's where we'll initiate our attack, correct? Yes. Now, let the trading begin. Choo! I think this might be the last cut. Choo, 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 choo. Stop right there. Your trading days are over. 
Dang, girl. Choo! Ah! What is the meaning of this? I was about to start my heroic monologue. No monologue. You don't have to introduce yourself to an enemy you're about to destroy. All they deserve is death. Wow. It's just weird behavior. This is supposed to be the meeting place, but there are only a few underlings. We had the right time. This has to be... Ha ha ha, you fell for it. The train is going down in another location as okay, we speak. Okay, it's not the last cutscene. They tricked us. You got that right, losers. I knew you pesky cats were going to mess with us, so I had to throw you off our tail. Trail. Trail. It could have been tail, too. Yeah, we aren't about to waste our time taking you on just to become cat food. That being said, we're out of here. There's no point in trying to defeat the god. We are unbeatable. Chew. Vert, they said there's no point. Should we give up? Of course not. Why do you even ask Right, that? I will never give up. I will bear no regrets. Okay. I'll have time to rest when I'm dead. I'm going to fight and fight and fight as long as I'm still breathing. Dang. Chew, this isn't good. Everybody, run for it. Dang, she got dark. Are you planning on running? You better start praying for a miracle. Because a miracle is the only way you will survive this. Oh my goodness, Bert. What? How did you get behind me so quickly? Please let me off easy, Chu. Oh, you want us to let you go? Try to defeat me and I'll consider it. If not, prepare to become dust. Dang. Chu. Foolish. You're the only one still standing. Chew! Vert, wait. We're going to let this one live for now. We have some questions we need answered. You can interrogate and torture me all you want, but I ain't no rat. Well, I guess I am, but I'll never talk. We have no plans on physically torturing you, but I'm not sure you'll be able to keep your sanity. Chew! So many cute girls! You placed raw meat over his eyes, and now he's just hallucinating? Did he just say girl? The vermin has seen an illusion. He thinks he's playing a dating sim with a bunch of pretty girls in it. But how is that torture? It sounds pleasurable, if anything. Why would you... Just give it a second, Bert. This is ridiculous. Uh, this is so relaxing. Everyone is so adorable. What's happening? It's begun. I can't save her! Why did this happen? He became so sad so quickly. What's going on with him? I'm making him relive every cruel and depressing scene from every game he's ever played. N no! No! Don't go in there! That's obviously a trap! You can't! Oh no! Your dad is going to- Ha! Ah, no! This scene's changed! Wait, why is the girl who confused- Confessed her love to the protagonist, turning into a rancid piece of meat. No, you can't just shoot her. She loves you. She doesn't deserve. Ah, she's been shot. I can't bear to watch this anymore. No! Please let me know when you'd like to answer a few questions so I can release you from your misery. That's so sad. <laughs> okay, then I guess we'll do... Just do verts and then we'll move on to Planet Tune. Um, um. There's so much. Sweet Castilia and a faint taste of Darjeeling tea. That refreshing aftertaste. I'm butchering some of these names. I simply yes. can't get enough of this winning combination. I can't get enough of your bedroom. <laughs> Sometimes I long for a re really sweet snack to pair with my tea. But much like Atome Games, there is such a variety of delectable pairings. Celestalas... I... that word. Celestalas are pretty and are popular in lean box, but they're so classic that I'm starting to feel they're not quite enough. Perhaps I could create a new specialty. For example, I could make a Castella large like my chest, and it could be made rounder. If it's in a box, it wouldn't crump it won't crumple even if it's soft. So I suppose it would be like a tiny box sponge cake, but larger. A tiny box does fit the image of lean box as well. Well, it's worth a try. I will work on it immediately. A tin box. Jesus Christ. 
Okay. Vert, I tried it out, that lean box specialty, boobs Castilla. <laughs> That's tin box Castilla. How was it? It was fluffy and really good, but can't you like do something special with it? Something special? Well, I do consider different ingredients, but I think plain is most fitting for a Castella. No, no, I'm not talking about the taste. I'm talking about the size. What? You know how there are usually three sizes for mouse pads, right? I think it's good to make something for reserved gentlemanly types. Gentlemen, uh, my words to I got it. Neptune, I said that they are not boobs, but perhaps it really should be best to have a smaller size for children. You're right. What about a blonde size one to start off? Oh, but then there would hardly be any volume for the cake at all. The hell did you say? <laughs> God, someone just like, manic, Man manically. manically threw a hat at us. We're being attacked. Now, now, blonde, you're not supposed to throw your hats around. Proper manners dictate that you're to be naturally whisk off your head. Forget about the stupid hat. You said that stupid stack wasn't boobs anyway. So why are you saying mine have no volume? Oh, my I don't remember explicit, explicitly saying... Explicitly. Speak, sp, <laughs> you, you screwed me up. Explicitly speaking about your breast, blonde, my dear. Uh, you've been reading like the whole thing, so you're probably messing uh, up way more than yeah. usual. Oh, man. If I stay here, an all-out boob war is going to break out for now. Just make four CPU sizes. I will take that advice to heart. That's hilarious. Hey, don't run away. Neptune, you come back too. <laughs> mm. Hey, this is pretty good. <laughs> what are you this is so stupid. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Let's see. Today's news is car racing tournament in Louis. This will also <laughs> feature the race queens. <laughs> car racing. Hmm. I've got a splendid idea. No. No ideas, Vert. The racetrack. No, Bert. No. Oh, that's so cute. You. Oh, right. <laughs> I was so used to not speaking. Bert, is this really going to sh gather any shares? This is a more revered racing tournament of game industry. If you stand here looking cute and sexy, your shares will skyrocket. That's right, Rom. Let's gather shares here and make our sister happy. But it's embarrassing. What are you saying? You are young ladies now, and it's about time you place more confidence in the powers you wield within your bodies. That's right, Rom. We'll bewitch the audience with our sexiness. We'll be twitch? What's that mean? Rom, this is how you pose. Like this? No, 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 no. You, your pose has to have a way more confidence than that, my dear sister. Remember the picture of Noir's cosplay that Uni secretly showed us? Do that. Those Noir pictures? Okay, I understand. Like this, right, Ram? That's right, you're super sexy. You're sexy too, Ram. Hmm, I suspected with the venue being in Louis, they're gathering the stares of citizens who are obsessed with smallness. It's frustrating, but in this nation, my large assets stand no chance of winning. However, it's quite a sight for sore eyes to see Ram and Ram's adorable figures. I can't stand this slightly immoral feeling ex yeah. excluding <laughs> from these immature soft bodies wrapped in these naughty adult costumes. Oh my goodness, this is this this weird. This picture will be a permanent record. Permanent record? My ass, you perverted low life. Exactly. Eek. You damn bitch, what do you think you're doing taking my younger sisters out without permission and making them do this? Rom, Ram, we're going home right now. What? But I was just getting used to it. No whining, invert. You know what's coming to you after this. Wait, what? Where'd she go? That ass hat she ran away, didn't she? You better be prepared next time. That was fantastic. Tee hee. <laughs> Like, vert. See if there's big... any. Okay, lean box is done for now. Go okay. to nap. Planet Tune. Planet Tune. I swear, if I had to fight. Wait, did you get the one thing where I don't have to fight? Nope. You have to do new, new game plus to get that. There's a lot. Is no. that one? No. no. It's only like. Oh just my goodness. Not that one. Don't do that one. Don't do East that, that. That that one triggers oh. new game plus, which it blatantly is obvious. Well, can I do this one then? Yeah, all the others to the left too. Okay. The two of us, <clears throat> sorry, the two of us have not 
had time to speak alone, away from all the noise. Allow me to formally welcome you home. Home, Uzume. My voice is like not wanting to do I'm that. I'm back. You're still using that hat from back in the day, aren't you, Eastwar? I only recently remembered that memory. I apologize. It's not your fault. I'm the one who erased everyone's memories. I'm the one who caused the problem in the first place. But, well, it managed to work out in the end, or rather, everyone made it work out in the end. <laughs> Especially Neptune. <laughs> it is thanks to you that the overlapping situations in this world were, world were resolved, and we simply had no way to regulate your power. It is... If you had not sealed yourself away along with your memories at the time, you may have perished along with this nation. I have no reason to blame you. In fact, all I can do is apologize. Hey, come on now. Don't get so down in the dumps. It's in the past. Even then, the one thing I cannot forgive is that no matter the reason, I have forgotten you. Somehow, I had a long history with. Someone. Oh, someone I had a long history with. Eastwar. But the reason I was able to remember was because of you, Uzume. Huh? Did I do something? Yes, you appeared in my dreams and helped me to remember. Hmm, strange things happen, don't they? Hey, I overheard your conversation. So it was a game industry-wide total amnesia episode. Whoa! Ne Neptune, please do not startle us when we are speaking of such a serious topic. I wasn't startled at all or anything. Hey, Nepsy, take a chill pill, okay? Maybe you should grab a pudding and go veg out somewhere. Who's me? I'm gonna pretend you didn't just say those things. I put them aside for now. <laughs> Man, if I hadn't gone to take a nap in the park that one time, who knows what would have happened to you, Uzume? Putting aside your slacking off of work, I must... I don't know what that word is. And, uh... The, I don't... I could have said it until you said something. I just... Okay, I'm not even sure what that word's supposed to be. But this is all thanks to Inquisize, you. I think. I never even heard sure, that word. I'm not even going to lie. Go for it. To your world with luck, Neptune. Did you skip parts? No, it's just that you kept talking when I was trying to read the sentence. Well, I was trying to... Whatever. Whatever, just go. <laughs> that how's them apples. Well, anyhow. I was saved because of Nepsi and the others fighting alongside me. And because of your support too, Eastwar, I'm really grateful. We worked pretty hard, didn't we? Indeed. There must have been much difficulty in this world and the other world, but you all have become so strong. If you if you put it that way, it's pretty embarrassing. But at the very least, I feel like I've gotten stronger since that time. Slam. Usume! Eek! Yeah. I developed a new system so I can add it to the virtual, uh, visual radio. It's okay, right? Gearsy. Oh, Uzume, that pose is showing off your gadget. Did you possibly sense that I was coming to remodel it? No, we were just talking about something pretty nice and... That's right, It re it's really nice. I think I can add cloud capabilities to it and data used, to, used in other terminals and... You can pack up your old data, or back up your old data, and synchronize the yada yada yada. Oh jeez, do what you want. Okay, please look forward to please look forward to it. Goodness, where should I start? What, Nepgear? You promised me you'd continue to work on the Umio Virtual Pet game. What? You've been working on developing something like that without me? Hey, Nepsy, I'll make it along with you guys. East War, I'll come back later. Goodness, this nation CPU CPUs is out of my hands. <laughs> okay, I gotta do his. Steam Max, I've decided I will publish a book in order to further my profit. Yeah. Oh, we will have a th we will have a thrilling royalty collecting life. However, I have never written a book as long as I have lived. Will you be my ghostwriter? A ghostwriter? Oh, I couldn't possibly. I haven't even managed to post fanfiction on Inchan, much less write a book. I apologize, but the most I could do is stealth market a book you've written, General. Hmm. Then I'll attempt to write one. Will you assist me, Steemax? Of course. There isn't much I can do, but I can help with revision or anything else. And this way, the long journey towards a royalty collecting life began. I think there's three cutscenes with them doing this. Yeah, let's do this. 
Hmm. First, we must figure out what book it should be. Any idea, Steemax? Busty Blondes. I think a cell phone novel would be quite interesting. But do you, you think that length would be simply even simple? Yeah, would be simple even for me. And furthermore, why don't we post a thread on Game Industry's number one anonymous board in chan and cheaply decide the contents? It should prove to be quite popular. Wahaha. Oh, an excellent plan. So you think so too? Uh, then let's immediately start a thread. Several hours later. Quite an awful mess has been created. Title, Your Universe, Sky. Protagonist, Arfi. First boyfriend, Shiva. Story. The protag Arfi is bullied by delinquents in the same class. Hectonchur Sato. Hectonchur Ouroboros and Arch Arc Lindworm. Ouroboros, furious at this, decides to, pu purge. to purge the bullies by writing about it in a cell phone novel and distributing it. Arfi uses her EXE drive when she learns of Ouroboros' retaliation on the bullies. The two hurt each other. Then the one who sh sh showed up in front of them was Ouroboros' ex, Moonbug. Um. This is incomprehensible. Mm -hmm. Putting aside the title and protagonist, the boyfriend's name is over the top. Mm. The delinquent names are morbid as well. They sound as if they have ridiculous amount HP, a ridiculous amount of HP and levels. And it's quite a mysterious turn of events that Ouroboros decides to expose the bullies when he himself was bullying Arfi. Who did Arfi use her EXE drive on? And under what circumstances? Why do they hurt each other and why a moon book? I've lost confidence. A cell phone novel is too much of an effort in the end. He gave up so quickly. Having excessive new lines, misspellings everywhere. Having insane amounts of ellips ellipses using emoticon faces. It's impossible for an old man like me. My senses can't keep up. Please cheer up, General. You can still write a book. It doesn't have to be a cell phone novel. I know. Why don't you write an autobiography about your successes with your blog? If it were a success story, I'm sure businessmen and rival bloggers would eat it right up. My word. As expected, Steemax. A wonderful proposal. Let's go with that. I knew we were an invincible pair. Gwaha! I love this bromance. <clears throat> In this way, Afi Mojo's... Yeah. Pro project for Bro a... Pro oh project for a royalty-collecting life progress very slightly. Every time I jack up, it's usually because you say <laughs> you jack it up right beforehand and I can't pronounce yeah. it. Now then, it's been some time, but I'd like to talk about my, my book publication. <laughs> I think it's best to decide the title first. Do you want to hang out with me too much? I figured you may ask, so today at a special price of 2,000 credits, I brought a helper. Thanks for the 2,000 credits. Leave the marketing profits to me. Oh, if I recall, you're B Shaw of Gold Third. Good work, Steemax. Now then, B Shaw, I would like to borrow your strength in order to decide on a title for my blog book. A title definitely needs to have some impact. You need them to be interested first. I suggest Alf in general. Weak. It doesn't have enough to do with the book co book's context. You you think people would buy it if the, that with that title? <laughs> Rejected. You're struggling today. Ah. Then, then why not Afi Mojas, Guardian Spirit Interview, 100 Secrets to Profit, Profits from the Guardian Spirit. It's a good eye catcher, but no. An interview with a Guardian Spirit sounds way too suspicious. Then what would be good? Let's see. How about Drafted by the General, How I Learned to Recruit, recruit 10 Million Hits a Day from the Creator of... At General Summary Site. Ooh, that title just smells of baiting <laughs> the money mongers owner, money mongering owners of summary sites. This way, we could stealth market it as a business book as well. Thank you for your business. Then the proposal and usage of the title. I'll take twenty percent royalties for each book sold. What? By the way, squeaky chair. I know, squeaky there's chair. Just two, there's two Neptunes. Okay, we might Neptune. have to call after these two, though. Misty, look, look. I tried making a new Planetune specialty. You actually made something. I have a bad feeling. 
Ta-da! This is Planty's new specialty. I call it Dr. Nepper. Oh my goodness, <laughs> yes! Oh my, that's very close. Your naming sense is always pushing it. Yeah, I know, you could call this a talent, you know. I was just thinking about all the people who who could get in We could get in we trouble. We could get in trouble with upsets my stomach. My Dr. Nepper is perfect for a time like this. It's good, got healing effects. Here, ISD, chug it. Um, very well then. Phew. I cannot believe it. My stomach ache has disappeared. Right? I bet my shares are going to soar because of this. This, this baby. Okay, well. This, then. this baby. <laughs> um, that will not heal the root cause of my stomach pain, however. What time are we on? It's just all these cutscenes. It's almost 30 minutes, and that's oh, not geez. counting the other one that we have, like, at least five minutes on. No. Remember, because we had a... Oh, no, I was just curious. Yeah. Phew, a nice warm bath is really relaxing. Oh, that's me. <laughs> hey, Nepgear, there's a sauna over there, right? I hear it's good for your skin. Wanna try it? Sure, I've always loved saunas. We should have a contest of who can stay in the longest. Whoever loses has to buy a drink for the other. All right, you're on, Uni. That sounds so dangerous. All right, my wallet's empty from paying for the bath, but with this I can drink some refreshing juice after getting out. I ran out of change and I gave up on the idea of a snack, but now I might be able to at least drink some tasty coffee milk after getting out. Oh my goodness, you girls. A few hours later. Oh. Oh. I wasn't expecting... I like this picture. What? Why don't you just give up already? You first, Uni. It's dangerous. Pass here. I'm not even at my limit. It's more dangerous for you. I'm fine. I used, I'm used to saunas. You're holding out well, though. I have a reason. I can't lose. What a coincidence. I can't lose either. You're stubborn as usual, I see. You too, Uni. These girls are so stupid. <laughs> I want to give up, but I can't bring myself to say that I have no money. I'm sure an idiot. I'm such, I'm, I'm such an idiot. Why did I bring up this contest? I can't give up now. Oh shoot, I just want some water. Water, someone give me water. I can't distract myself. I'll steal myself to endure this through sure. Upstance. Oh my god. We have problems today. But. I'm at my limit. Whoop. Sauna, sauna. Whoa, wait, Nepgear and Uni, are you alright? Hey, hey! <laughs> that was very bad, you two. You shouldn't push yourself so hard over a silly contest. Oh, it's a dot nip. To top it off, the reason you were both holding on was because you didn't want to admit to the other that you both were broke. I'm sorry. Me too. I hope you two will reflect on this and learn, okay? Okay. Good. Okay, I'm heading into the sauna. Nepgear, I'm um, sorry. I'm sorry too, Uni. I know if we can combine our change together, maybe we can manage to buy a drink to share. All I have is 50 credits. You too? I only have 50 credits too. Let's get a drink together, Uni. Okay. Alright, we good? We probably should call it good. We'll finish the Alright, well there will be another episode then because we still got quite a bit to do. But if you enjoy, like and subscribe and we'll see you all for the next episode. See ya! Laters!